Hi YouTube, this is Amelia Rose and I'm going to show you how to make an herbal bath today. It's super simple and today we're going to be using some chamomile and lavender that I dried straight from the store. Hi YouTube, this is Amelia Rose and I'm going to show you how to make an herbal bath today. It's super simple and today we're going to be using some chamomile and lavender that I dried straight from the store. Hi, all we're using today is some fresh chamomile or fresh lavender that I got from the store and dried here at home along with some chamomile that I bought at a store. All you would need is a little muslin bag, a reusable tea bag, um, and I got this bag at a local tea shop for like a dollar. And you just take a couple of teaspoons of chamomile, which is really nourishing to the skin, very mild. Um, a couple of sprigs of lavender. You can always take a couple more. However much you want. You can fill the bag. Um, I like to leave a little space in there. Uh, that's up to you, your choice. And what this will do is it'll not only make this water smell really nice, but it'll also be really nice for your skin. And you can pick any type of herb, your choice. I just happen to really like the smell of lavender and chamomile. Admit, also, both are considered very calming and relaxing herbs, so you all you would have to do is put warm water in a tub, however, 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 temp, however warm you want it. Toss this into the tub and just let it soak. When you're done, you can just squeeze it, squeeze out any excess water, put it, put it off to the side, and you can reuse it at least another. You can use it at least one to two times, usually two to three. Um, and it's super simple. And again very relaxing, good for your skin, hydrating, and that's it. Super simple. So see you next time. Thanks. Bye.